Chapter 31 I got a feeling something was wrong about 2 or 3 a.m. Bless was calling for me. We didn't need cell phones. She was lighting up my cells all right, and I got up immediately. Freddie let me borrow the van, no questions asked. There was a brunette across the way just itching to take my spot. I turned and looked her up and down, turned my head so fast she didn't have time to turn away. She blushed, but I stepped over to her and not one of us, but she would do. I asked her what she drank. She said Cosmo. I told the bartender to bring her one. Then I got the keys and took an open air elevator down to the dance floor. All the guys and girls let off a giant exhalation as they pulsed to the music. Some dude with eyes bigger than his face came over like he was going to touch me. I pushed a toe swiftly into his abdomen, then danced my leg up past the perpendicular until my heel caught him under the chin. Did you need something? He was standing like someone too proud. Maybe a little ego deflation. I brought my foot back down and his jaw dropped after it. Nine Inch Nails was on the deck. I could feel it before they could. Mostly humans here, but there were some who fell not far from our tree. I looked up and saw at least 20 cryptids folded in the shadows of the upper level lurking around the dance floor. I could barely make out the bloodlust half smiles. Then came Reznor's wonderful refrain. Bow down before the one you serve. You're going to get what you deserve. A sweep of light sinked in with the music at that time, tried but failed to capture me as I stole at superhuman speed through the seemingly frozen bodies backed up toward the entrance, in a crooked line to the gates and out into the streets. The dancing swelled with a fervor. The sweetest thing about a club that size is that truth is always presumed stranger than fiction, so almost all the rules can be broken. Everyone needs some shelter from the rules. The girl was already on her second Cosmo, courtesy of Freddy, who wanted nothing more than to loosen her up. He shot me a sweet sentiment through the telepath as I fired up the van. Be careful, boo.